Hello friends, welcome to my channel Creating Essence. You want me to carry you? Okay. I am Megan and thank you so much for stopping by today. It's a shopping day. I've been on a little bit of a self-imposed pantry challenge where we're just trying to use up what's in the fridge and freezers and cupboards because it's produce season. It's gardening and getting all sorts of good stuff that way. You got him? Yep. Oh, and he's got a bunch of my hair. So today we're getting lots of staple things and um, gonna load up on lots of groceries. Come along. It's uh, almost one o'clock already. It's a pretty, it's a long day. <laughs> now, after I show it to you, I gotta get it all put away. Plus, I still have to feed people lunch. So, let's check it out. Um, from Aldi to start, we have eight bags of the organic yellow corn tortilla chips. Got this for a special treat to have with lunch. It's, you know, a long list, but not horrible. Six dozen eggs. I know I get the question all the time. You do so much to feed everybody. So healthy, why eggs from the store? Because we're not getting eggs from our own chickens yet. And we buy local when we can, and we supplement from the store. So that's why we get eggs from the store. We have three pounds of non-GMO clementine oranges. Got a bag of red onions, two of all these never any whole chickens. They are, let's see if we can see the list, no hormones, no steroids, no salt, not injected with water, no antibiotics, ever. So, uh, it's one of those best options in the marketplace. Needed some more baking soda. My oldest saw the brie and asked for some. She's kind of my... Uh, sophisticated palate of the kids. <laughs> we got some of their salami, which is a pretty good option. Bag of organic lunchbox peppers. A little box of organic baby spinach, because my oldest loves that for salads. Two things of pomegranate lifeway kefir, because my kids love it on Saturday morning with their bagels. And we like to keep one of these things, dry roasted unsalted peanuts. It's just peanuts. No oils or anything, just peanuts. And now on to Costco. I have five pound bags each of organic green beans, organic corn, organic peas, and whole blueberries. These are just freezer staples I like to have in the freezer. Corn, we buy every few months maybe. Uh, the Beans and peas we get pretty much every time we go, um, unless we're getting them fresh from the garden. Got a big bag of the power greens, which is the chard, kale, and spinach. We like those for salads and things. Two bags of the Asiago bagels. One will be the kids' Saturday morning bagels for breakfast tomorrow. The other one will go in the freezer and be for next Saturday. It's just a nice treat that they like to have. Got a nice big bag of the organic cacao powder. A box of the Kerrygold Mom. butter. Mom. Oh, you want a banana? Yeah. Okay. Mom. Mom. Here you go, buddy. Say thank yeah. you. Yeah. We got two two pound bags of the Mayorga organic dark roast coffee beans, my absolute favorite. Two bags of avocados. A two and a half pound bag of organic chia seeds. A big bag of lemons. We use them in so many things and in vinaigrettes. This is one of the few prepared products we found there that we really like. It is grass fed, humane. It's actually a really good product. It's all beef. And the ingredient list is solid. We are really Really pleased with these. No added sugar, just good stuff. Two packs of those. 
We got the a big thing from Costco of the Organic PB Fit. We like this for smoothie, smoothies, especially my husband with his uh, workouts and stuff. This is just organic peanuts and organic coconut sugar. So it does have sugar, but it's a good product. Box of tomatoes until we start getting our tomatoes from the garden. A case of mangoes the kids love. They asked for some raspberries to have with lunch today, and since we're not getting enough raspberries from the raspberry canes for meals, I said sure. Got a two pound box of the sun gold kiwis. The kids really love those. Three pounds of the smoked nitrate free uncured bacon. Nice big bucket of sour cream. We like the Breakstones because it is cultured naturally. There's no thickeners or gelatin or anything in it. These are a special treat that the kids like, the figgy pops. They are cranberries, apricots, dates, cashew and almond butter, pepita seeds, organic cashews, sunflower seeds, almonds, figs, coconut oil, coconut, sea salt, cinnamon, sesame seeds, and ginger. That's all that's in it. All organic, non-GMO. They're little, like, kind of like power balls. They love them. Nice big bag of dates. My husband loves those when he wants a sweet snack. Dried cherries. It's my youngest two's favorite snacky thing. Got a 10-pound bag of organic carrots. A brick of Asiago cheese. A brick of Kerrygold cheddar and two two pound bags of Brussels sprouts. We also got this big jug o uh, vinegar, because I use it in so many things, and a case of crushed tomatoes. I am really hoping to get more of my own tomatoes canned this year so we can stop buying those all together. And now onto Wegmans. We have a big one gallon jug of their organic, unfiltered, natural uh, apple cider vinegar. A five pound bag of butter potatoes, two things of green onions, a head of cabbage. I got one of these plain Greek yogurt with the five cultures because I want to make some crock pot yogurt. I'll put a link to that. Got some cilantro because we're gonna make our own salsa. Two packs of the rice noodles. We love rice noodles. It's just rice as an ingredient. Yeah. You want some cheese? Yeah. Okay, just a minute, please. We like to do stir fries and things and just Wait. smother these in veggies. No. Yes. Wegmans had a bunch of their chicken on sale today, so Wait. I got two whole roasters on manager special for 62 cents a pound yeah. each. Yeah. Have oops, an organic whole milk gallon. I found this. No. We haven't tried it before, but my husband loves spicy stuff. So, sweet habanero cholula. Yay. Yay. And two pounds of pinto beans. Yay. I'll get your cheese in a second, baby. Yay. Got the kids some cream cheese for tomorrow's bagels. 20 pounds of bananas. A nice big ginger root, because we use it in so many things. Whoa. A big pack of baby portobello mushrooms. More chicken on special. These are the thighs bone in. They were 69 cents a pound. I got three packs of those. Got a case of cans of black beans for a good protein in a pinch when I can't cook them up from dried. Three things of the unsweetened almond milk because my husband likes it. We got almost five pounds of broccoli crumbs. Just a minute, please. You're being very impatient. Yay. Two heads of cauliflower, uh, some celery, a three pack of cucumbers. I can't wait till we're getting our own cucumbers Yay. from the garden. Some cotton candy grapes, because my kids love them. A six pack of bell peppers. And lastly, eight pounds of empire apples. In total, uh, I spent just over $400, which is about $50 over budget. But like I said, <laughs> uh, I did a self-imposed pantry challenge the last two weeks, which it comes with its own benefits. 
Um, it means we didn't spend much on groceries last the last two weeks, but it also means that we spent extra this time to kind of restock on staples that we had used up. So that is all. If you would like to know how we use any of these things, let me know. If you have any questions, put them in the comments below. I'm happy to chat. And yeah, give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe to our channel for more videos like this. Bye-bye, friends. Good day.